One day, my avó was upset because I couldn't recall where I had left my backpack. So she had to buy a new one for me. Luckily, I managed to convince her not to ground me. Then at night, I had a lucid dream. As soon as I became lucid, I mentalized my other self to call him for an adventure. But someone else showed up. Hello, I'm a messenger. I came to inform you that your other self is in a deep meditation and cannot be disturbed at the moment. What? Why? He needs to restore his energy if he wants to become one with you. I need him now. He can sleep later. He cannot be disturbed. I've told you this once, but you don't remember all your dreams. Just get out of my world! Uh-oh. I woke up in the morning with a horrible headache. I saw stars all day long and I was feeling like having a million ants walking all over my body. At night, I had another lucid dream and my garden was already there. I'm innocent. Are you? I didn't say a word and you're already defending yourself. I didn't know he would attack me. Quiet. He did not attack you. You attacked a body that was pure light. You only got hurt because your energy is nothing compared to his. I'm sorry, okay? Oh, you're sorry now? You almost blew up all your chakras last night. I had to duct tape them together to keep you alive. Some are still blocked and that will cost you. You'll be very lucky if you can talk to your other self outside your dreams after what you did. Oh no. It's better that way so people won't call you crazy. And I'm not done with you yet. You disrespected one of the masters, so you're definitely grounded. Did you say grounded? No more adventures for you. And you better not do anything stupid again because I will be watching you. Ow. I woke up and I was a bit concerned about being grounded because he didn't say for how long. Days later, my hand was healed from the dog bite and I had another lucid dream. But the same wall was still there. I couldn't even teleport myself out of there. This was bad. So I asked my avó for an advice. I told her I was grounded in my dreams and she said it was probably my own guilty conscience doing that because I had lost my backpack. Then one night, I had another lucid dream and the wall was still there. Hello, I came here to tell you something that you should know about. How did you go through that wall? That wall is inside your mind. It does not block me. Can you help me get rid of it? Your guardian wouldn't allow me. Please? Hmm... Deep, 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 what are you deep. doing? It's a hiding spell. If your guardian looks at you, he will see you meditating. But he can still listen to your emotions screaming. So calm down your heart, or he might get suspicious. Okay, so you can destroy the wall now? Your guardian is stronger than I am. If I try to destroy the wall, he will know and he will likely come to stop us. You need four guardians of nature to stop him. So I called all guardians of nature that crossed paths with me in the past, and they came. Can you all help me to destroy the wall? As you wish. The only way to destroy the wall is by burning it. I can burn it for you, but I don't want you free. His guardian will try to stop us. Perfect. I can't wait to burn him again. I'm in. Thanks. What about you, fish? Mm, let me think. No! Goodbye. And never summon me again. Why is she so angry? I think she's mad because you're neglecting your feminine side. He can destroy his guardian with the three of us. I beat him once with only three. He did see four guardians in here, so maybe he's too scared to come back. Let us blow the wall. <laughs> Oops, trust your heart. <sighs> I'm... Quiet! You conspired against me. I just wanted to be free. If you want to be free, then so be it. I am done helping you. You can ask your nature buddies for help from now on. I'm out. Sayonara. Goodbye and good luck. I'm really sorry. Don't leave me. He's just upset. I will tell him you meant no harm. He will listen to me. I didn't want to upset him. Let me tell you a secret about him. He might look all tough and cranky. But when you make mistakes, he cries like a child. Please don't tell him I told you that. Sorry for touching you. It's okay. I'm sorry you got injured. It's a natural protection I have. How do you do it? With time. I'm here much longer than you. I still remember when you first came to this planet. You had no home. 
but you loved nature so much that the planet adopted you as a daughter. I don't remember any of that. Every cycle you empty your glass so you can learn new things. You are very brave to do that. Your memories are gone, but the heart never forgets. So with time, you end up making less and less mistakes until the day you finally find your inner peace and true happiness. That's when life becomes a paradise. But sadly, that's also when you learn that your cycle is over and you can no longer go back. And you want to go back? I would love to breathe the air once again, to see the sunlight and to rediscover love. But my time has ended. For now, I'm devoted into helping those who still struggle. It was nice talking to you, human. I wish you peace and good. I woke up and tried to contact my other self, but I could not get any response from him. It took me quite a while to get another lucid dream after that day. But when I finally did, the guardian of nature showed up. Hello, last time I came here to tell you something, but I didn't. Mm. I'm making deals to change people's sexes in exchange for my help in life. Those who accept my deal will be born with the sex opposite of what they were used to. Why? To help control the human population. But I won't need to do that for too long. Why not? Mother's getting weaker every day. If they don't stop destroying this planet. Oops. You interrupted. Good. You are dealing with beings you cannot understand. I'm glad you're back. I've decided to give you one more chance. One. Don't disappoint me again. I wish you peace and light. Ow. Oh, by the way, you're still grounded. Thanks for watching my video. In the next video, I talk about the day I was summoned to do a dream job. So make sure you subscribe to my channel to not miss my stories. Every video is similar to this one, so check out my other videos, which should help you understand what's going on. And don't forget to leave a like and a comment. Thanks for being nice. Bye.